Welcome. In this quick video, we are going to show you our best practice and procedures on the Q360 valve installation. Position the valve at least 5 feet away from the pool, but otherwise as close as possible to reduce plumbing costs. The valve should be placed in an easily accessible location to allow for servicing. Remove the gear cassette and turbine from the valve to protect them from plumbing debris and to allow for equal distribution during pressure testing. When plumbing the valve housing, use medium or heavy bodied cement with a compatible primer. Do not use blue or hot glues. Do not get glue in the gear housing as it will void the warranty. Install lines a minimum of six inches below grade or in accordance to local codes. Use a three inch stagger when cutting pipes to provide enough clearance for all lines. Install the valve so that the lid and band clamp are at least 3 inches above the water level of the main body of water to allow for servicing. If all outlet ports are not called for in the pool plan, combine the ports in the valve as specified on the plan. If the pool has any raised body of water connected to the cleaning system such as a raised spa, a check valve must be used on that line to prevent the raised body from draining to lower bodies of water. If a below water level installation is necessary, shutoff valves must be installed on all lines to prevent flooding during service. This is an example of what your valve installation should look like. Pressure test the system at a minimum of 35 psi and in accordance with local codes. Verify that the system is holding pressure, then relieve system pressure at the filter gauge. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact one of our Blue Square support specialists.